The Jewish community really began not too long after Phoenix itself began in the mid to late 1870s. One of the first prominent uh, Jewish citizens of Phoenix was a man named Emil Gans, and he was quite an entrepreneur. He came into the valley and and built and started a really prominent hotel right on Washington Street. It was called the Bank Exchange Hotel, and uh, it catered to a fairly high-level visitor at the time. Unfortunately, in the mid-1800s, there was a big fire right in that area and it burned to the ground. But being the entrepreneur that he was, he wasn't dissuaded. He got into the wholesale liquor business. Um, he also became mayor. He was a twice elected mayor. He was the president of the National Bank of Arizona in the early days. So he was a very prominent uh, Jewish person in the very earliest days of Phoenix.